So it's been about four months. I promised a follow-up video. Had to get a few bugs worked out of the truck. <clears throat> Still hoping to get some new tires, but everything else is pretty well dialed. Went ahead and built bumpers for it. Didn't really want to at first, but uh, I started taking the truck off-road a little more than I originally planned on and figured I should probably protect it. Went ahead and added a receiver. Normally wouldn't have that in there, but just checking it out. A couple side gussets. These go through the cross member and they're double sleeved. You've got an inch and a half inside, inch and a quarter with a cap. Very, very strong. As you can see, the truck's been getting used as a truck like this should be getting used. I've done a couple revalves on the shocks, changed my bump pad height on the front there. Did go ahead and build half doors out of the doors from the old cab over there. Interior is pretty much the same. Added a tack. A little high right now on the revs, but been messing with that lately. Threw a toolbox on, thanks to my buddy Tyler. You can see here are my propane tanks. Got a luggage divider here. For when I go camping, I can strap my camping gear down. Built up this rear bumper just for clearance and a little protection. Want to make sure the license plate could be seen. You can see here I got a little body damage. That happens. I did the Chevy 63 inch springs with seven and a half inch shackles. I also twisted up the rear drive shaft on some rocks. So I went ahead and built this one with a sleeved piece of two inch pipe on the inside. show you the propane real quick. This is the GOT propane kit. Well worth every penny. Also did new NGK plugs and wires. Very happy with it.